Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Julia and I'm currently a second year medical student. And back in February, I filmed a video about me getting my second shot of a Moderna vaccine for COVID. A lot of you guys were interested in my experience, so I decided why not in this video, I can film my experience with the Moderna booster vaccine for COVID. It is November 7th and it is around 4.40 right now. So I'm gonna get my shot in about 45 minutes. I hope you guys all enjoy this video and I will see you guys at my next update. I forgot to tell you guys that I actually have a neuroanatomy coming up on the 15th and I was planning on getting the booster shot and then heading into the anatomy lab to do some in-person studying because I feel like when I'm studying for anatomy, the most effective way is for me to be in the lab in person versus learning it like on my computer by PowerPoints or images. I forgot to preemptively take like a Tylenol before the booster shot. I was planning on doing so just because I thought it might help. Hopefully it's not gonna be too big of a deal and I can still get a couple hours of studying in the lab today. I will continue to update you guys further and yeah, I'll see you guys all later. So I'm gonna go head out and meet up with a friend to go get the vaccine together. This is my friend Mara. <laughs> How do you feel? Pretty good yeah. going in. <laughs> Thank you. You're very welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm feeling good. Yeah. <laughs> Waiting for 15 minutes now. Yeah. Updates more to come later. <laughs> I just got back from anatomy lab and I just wanted to go in and look at the different parts of the skull, like the different bones and the foramen. I think I went over everything that I wanted to. It's around 7.30 now, so it's been two hours since I got the shot and I still feel really good. I don't really feel like much, like even on my arm. I can't even say it's sore. I'm probably just gonna take it easy for the rest of the night and try to make sure that I drink enough water and get some dinner inside of me, but I'll update you guys all later. Misu, Misu, sit. <laughs> There's what pause. Misu, down. Misu, bang. There's <laughs> a good boy. Misu, spin. Good boy. Sit. Okay, go get <laughs> All right, I will see you guys all later. at all at this point so it's been about six hours since i got the shot i apologize for the audio if it's a little low because i'm trying to whisper my roommate's sleeping and i don't want to bother her or wake her up and misu's also trying to go to sleep too i think i'm going to also take a tylenol before i go to bed i'm not sure if last time i started feeling the side effects by now i do remember that it didn't really kick in like super quickly um, I'm just hoping this time it doesn't kick in at all, but if it does, hopefully the Tylenol will do its trick. I am probably going to try to study a little bit more for my anatomy exam because I feel very behind, and then hopefully I'll go to bed before 2 a.m. and I continue not to feel any side effects. Actually, the one thing I do feel is my arm just feels a little sore now before I mentioned it wasn't sore at all, but it's not too bad. It's nothing that I can't just work past or live through, I guess. So far, so good. So I will continue to update you guys tomorrow. 
night, y'all. Oh. Oh. Ow, Misu, what? I already played with you. <laughs> hey, no, that's not nice. Hey guys, so it is now 11.37 of the next day, and I was feeling actually really good all night until around like 6 a.m. At 6 a.m. that's when I started to feel like a little warm and a little bit of the chills. My body didn't start to feel good enough for me to get out of bed until around 11, so around five hours of feeling like warm and a little bit of chills. I do also feel like very sore, like all my muscles feel very sore, but it's not too bad. I expected the chills to be similar to last time and they were a lot better this time around. It wasn't as severe, I would say. Not that last time it was that bad to begin with, but yeah, all in all, I think things are only gonna improve from here. Yeah, and I didn't end up taking any more Tylenol or Advil. I just took the two last night and maybe that's the thing that did the trick until 6 a.m. But I'm gonna try to stay hydrated and maybe I will take another Tylenol. But I feel like overall not too bad. I will continue to update you guys for the next day, but I think those updates will be very short because I don't really see myself getting any more side effects, but who knows? So yeah, until later. <laughs> sit down he's a bang good boy sit oh <laughs> Missy why do your legs look like that
12.21 now of the next day, and actually all day I was feeling very weak and sore, which I didn't expect the soreness and achiness to last so long. I feel like for the second Moderna shot that I got, the symptoms were a little worse, but not as long. I went into the anatomy lab today after I dragged myself out of bed really late in the day and I was standing there and, and like my muscles were starting to get very achy. It's been around over a little over 30 hours since I got the vaccine and I'm feeling so much better. I feel like the lingering body aches is starting to go away which is good because tomorrow I need to get back into studying so yeah I think I'm gonna give maybe one or two updates tomorrow. So yeah that is my 30 hour update and now I'm gonna try to get some more studying done and then go to bed as soon as possible hopefully before 2 a.m. It's my goal I feel like every night at this point I'll give you guys all an update tomorrow. <laughs> since I got my vaccine and as I expected my side effects didn't get worse um, and I didn't get any additional side effects so the only thing that kind of lingered a little bit more was like my arm was just like slightly sore when I raised it but barely no noticeable this is my last final update and now I have to get back to studying for my neuroanatomy exam as always thank you so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and I'll see you guys all next time